my opinion, guys, this card is borderline team of the season level. Paolo Dybala has won the Serie A Player of the Month yet again. 90 rated, his current best card on the game. Let's put him into a team and see what he can do. Are you tired of coming up against absolutely insane teams? Well, today I've got a solution for you. Welcome to LootBar.gg, the fastest, safest, and most reliable, as well as cheapest coins I have seen for FC24. You can receive your coins as fast as 30 minutes, and also they offer full refunds if you're not happy with the product. Here is me making an order of 100,000 coins. As you can see, as we go across to the game, I've only got 489,000 coins. I also got a message from the customer service team, and they told me exactly exactly what I need to do to get my coins. And there we have it guys, just like that, in about 20 minutes I have received my 100,000 coins. Not only that, they offer 24 seven customer support, so if you do need help with your order, you are in good hands. You can also trust lootbar.gg with a 4.6 rating on Trustpilot and absolutely amazing reviews, which you can see right now on your screen. So if you want to upgrade your team on FC24, make sure you go to lootbar.gg, link in the description. So, Paolo Dybala, four star, four star, high low, five foot 10, and mostly explosive, very good base card stats. He's going to cost you an 87 rated squad and an 85 with a team of the week. As we go to the play styles, he's actually had a pretty good upgrade here. Finesse plus, amazing. Dead ball is actually very, very good. Ping pass is an amazing play style to have on a forward. Technical, flare plus, which is a little bit sad. First touch, acrobatic and Traveller, which is just... Wow, what a set of play styles he's got, especially with the upgrade to his weak foot to four star instead of three star. In terms of alternates, he comes out as a right wing, which is quite cool. Right mid, centre forward and striker are the other alternates. Being from the Serie A and Argentinian, links are very, very tasty for this card as well. Poor pace split, but acceleration is more important than sprint speed. He's got 92 and 84. Really good shooting across the board with 88 attack position and 90 for his finishing and shot power. 95 long shots. 96 volleys and 93 penalties. Now, because he's got acrobatic, then volleys are quite nice to see. He's got 96 vision. Wow. 87 crossing, 93 free kick accuracy, 91 short pass, 84 long pass, and 94 for his curve. This card is already looking mental. 92 agility, 94 balance. And then the little issue comes in here, guys, with the reactions and also the composure. 83 and 85 for reactions and composure. Still shouldn't really be an issue, but is a bit on the low side if you ask me. 97 ball control and 94 dribbling. Just bonkers, man. He's also got 80 stamina, which is a little bit on the low side. Now, chem styles for this card, I'm going to try out a few and see what they look like. The first one I wanted to look at, which is a bit of a waste, is the marksman. The reason I like the marksman is obvious. It's to boost the reactions up to 87. He goes up to 99 ball control and dribbling. Gets a decent boost to his jumping and strength as well, up to 73 strength there. Goes up to 98 finishing, 94 shot power and 99 long shots. It's a mental, mental upgrade that. And then the other one I wanted to take a look at um, before we actually do commit to a chem style was a maestro. Once again, the maestro does do up the reactions really, really nicely actually. 91 reactions now with 99 dribbling. Goes up to 99 vision and free kick accuracy, 95 for his short pass, 92 long pass. 98 shot power, 99 long shots and volleys. That's a really good boost. Um, but I think for this card, he's just a little bit slow. So your options are you either boost the reactions or you boost the pace. I'm going to go with the pace, I think, just because he is a little bit slow. You know, the sprint speed's so low, you do kind of need to boost it. With this, he goes up to 92 sprint speed and 99 acceleration. So it's a pretty hefty boost, to be fair, like 95, 96 pace. He goes up to 92 attack positioning. 98 finishing, 94 shot power, maxed out volleys and penalties. I think that's a really good boost, guys. I think this card looks genuinely insane for the price of it. We're going to be playing him as the right centre forward to try to finesse shots out on just stay forward. Let's get into a few games and see what he can do. Alrighty then, guys. First game now coming up with uh, Paolo Dybala. This guy's team name is funny. It's Katazuma. Nice, nice. Casillas, Yashin, Todibo. Good team, good team. And a very, 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 very good team name. Right. Palo Dybala time. Now, I remember I reviewed his Winter Wild card. Absolutely loved that, that item. I thought he was absolutely incredible. Is that Dybala there as well? Come on, Paolo. Let's see it. Great sprint boost. Oh, good save. Good save. Nearly scored straight away there, guys. 
He's not going to be good in the air, is he? But he's more acrobatic. Oh, 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 a bit unlucky straight away here, in my opinion. We should have scored there. Should have scored there. Wow, that's a good ball. This Athena is so annoying. Every time I play against her, she's just a demon. Nice, Ruben. Still one of my favourite midfielders on the game, by the way, guys. A bit hard to link because I don't have many Serie A players. But I really do like that Loftus-Cheek. I'm driving to the space here. Go on the inside. Nice. Dybala is there. It's a great first touch. Dybala, that is nice. Back into him as well. Oh, Okafor. Oh, he's got to find that. We're going to go 1-0 down here because of that as well. Oh, that's a bit jarring. I mean, wow. Oh, dear. Oh, he just gets... To... Why does he get the re... What is the need for the rebound there, man? You did not need to give him the rebound. It was a great save. Oh, bad start here, man. Well, not actually. Not for Dybala. Again with it. Wow, he's dribbling, man. Oh, yes, please. Oh, my days. This dribbling, guys, feels like Team Media Messi. It really, really does. This guy's playing so weird, isn't he? Oh, welcome to Friday Daytime Champs, is what I would say to this. He is with Athena again. I'm not too worried here. Maybe I should be. Nah. Dybala's going to receive this here too. Can he find that? I'm interested to see if he can find that. Nice. I mean, it's not where I have aimed it. I wanted it at Okafor, but still went a bad ball. Yeah, this guy's really, really good. <sighs> we're going to 2-0 down. I can't, I can't believe we're 2-0 down in this game. This is robbery. Okay, okay. We need to wake up a little bit. Dybala's been good here, though. Look at that R1 dribbling. I don't know how. I don't know how. This might have to be highlights because I'm not losing my first game of champs on this account today. It, this game's literally robbing me here. We're going to stay live. We're going to stay live. I'm not going to moan. We're going to get back into the game. Go on, Oka 4, please. I can't believe we're 2-0 down, though. I really can't. It's just two big counter-attacks, isn't it? It's how I concede all of my goals on this game. Into Dybala here. Nice pass. Back into him as well. He's got a bit of time on the ball here as well. We're going to go into... Loftus does really, really well. Here is Dybala again. Oh, he's got ping pass, remember? He's got ping pass. Oh, oh, this is a this is a strange, strange game here. Nice, nice bruiser there. Bruiser's a great play style, isn't it? Nice, okay. We, we, we need you there. No, where are my options? I've got no options. I mean, I did win it back there where I shouldn't have, I suppose. Oh, stressful, stressful, stressful early doors here. Dybala again. Find it, find it. Good pass into Okafor. Okafor. Beats his man. Casillas is still there, though. Win that, Ruben. You're good in the air. Nice. What is happening? There you go. There's one back. Okay. <laughs> okay. Dybala has been involved quite a lot here already, I would say. But early doors here, guys. We're just trying to feel out his dribbling. So I think what we might do, actually, for this game here, until I get back into it, maybe, is go... Hold on. I've got to show you this if he, if he scores this. He actually has. <laughs> Yeah, we're going to highlights. We're going to get back into the game. And we're going to see what Dybala can do. This is such a joke. Dybala, again, lots of space out here. We're going to look for this pass as well. It's a lovely pass with a ping pass as well. Oh, my. I I, 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 I have no words for this game, guys. <laughs> Dybala, again, beats his man comfortably as well. Ping pass. Nice, nice assist for him there. He is going to be really good on that right centre forward or out wide, guys. Because... He's got the ping pass, and you can obviously go inside as well and look for the finesse shot. A lot of this has came from the uh, the upgrade to his uh, his weak foot, allowing him to be so good there. And, of course, finesse plus really helping too. I can't believe this. What is happening? Bala again. Nice. I'll look for him again here. It's a good ball. Dybala can drive into the space. It's nice. Hello, Dybala. Dybala. Oh, bad finesse shot. I didn't green it. It probably wasn't the right angle. I don't know how that's a corner. What I'm going to attempt to do here, though, guys, I'm going to look for a Travella. I'm going to look for a Travella. I'm not going to look for a Travella. And now this is a big counter-attack for this dude. One Dybala, make that run. One Dybala. This is nice. Ping pass again. You really do get to see the value of ping pass on this card, guys, because you can just cut inside, bait out the finesse shot, or look for the, the, uh, the ping pass across. It's really quite OP. Nice dribble in. Really nice dribbling, actually. As well to turn there as well. Nice. Dybala made the run. Dybala. He's moved the keeper. That was a good effort, though. Oh, he's run it back. Oh. 
Don't you dare blow up. That's a foul. That's a pen. Yeah, it is. Wow. Okafor and Dybala involved there. Now, oh, this man has got absurdly good penalties. 99 penalties here, guys. See if he can slam it home. Let's see it. Yeah. Oh! Ho -ho! Wow. Wow. Hold on. What? How? 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 I think he gave it offside there, didn't he? I really, really like this card's dribbling. He, he really does struggle with, like, being super weak. But I just don't think it really matters because he's so good dribbling-wise. You know, he's never going to win anything in the air for you. I didn't really want that played like that, sadly. But, yeah, he, he, he's, he, he has one problem, really, and it's how weak he is. I wish this card actually had a Tiki Taka Plus. Oh, my days. Oh, if he had Tiki Taka Plus instead of Flare Plus, I think it would just be curtains. Nice. Time to turn as well. Little dink there into Ruben. Ruben should be getting to that. That's lovely. Dybala. Dybala. What a finish as well, guys. That is really well worked. Really well worked. Go on, then. Let's see it. Let's see it. Let's see it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, my God. What a traveller. Here he goes again. Oh, he's dribbling, you know. Good little pass there as well into Okafor. It's gone back into Dybala as well. Wow. That was one of the best challenges I've ever seen. Come on, your finesse shot's been quite bad so far, Paolo. Wow, that's spinning behind there. Oh, man. See, now, we've done like three or four finesse shots in this game, guys. Haven't scored a single one. Fair enough. Maybe bad angles. One Trevella. What? And it was an insane Trevella, may I add. And it's and we scored off of it. So maybe don't play this card on the uh, on the right. Maybe look at playing him on the left. He's got time to drive here as well. We're going to go back down there. Oh, I don't know how he's found that out. That I was going to do that. That's really clever. It's a good ball. His passing feels really, really nice as well. I haven't really talked about that too much. Yeah, his passing... What a goal that is. This card feels insanely good, man. And he's so cheap as well. I think you're going to see him in quite a lot of people's teams, guys. Look at that. He just feels so, so responsive. Oh. Oh, go on then. No. For some reason, guys, I don't know what it is. I know we didn't get it off there. I don't really like his finesses. I don't really like his finesse shots. Nice work, Dybala, to get away from that press there. This guy is all over me at the minute. What are his Travellers? Oh. oh, please. Oh, my word, guys. He is the long shot king. Like, <laughs> that's our first finesse shot goal. I'm going to keep him over here. I am going to keep him over here for the second game. Okay, guys. So, a lot of highlights and a lot of talk in that first game. We're going to go live for the second game. I was blown away by how good this man is. Genuinely. Wow. Wow. I don't want to overstate how good he actually feels. But he has got insane responsiveness. Can pass on both feet. Has got ping pass, which is so OP for playing him out wide. It just feels like a card that shouldn't be as cheap as it is. You know, oh, I didn't even aim that there. Got a bit lucky there. Here's Dybala. Good arm on dribbling straight away. Look at how he moves. And because you can come inside like this and then do that, you've got to think that playing him off the right still isn't bad. If you if you know if you want to dribble inside like that, you can still do the same sort of thing. Um geez, that's a good pass. He just feels a bit a bit too good for what it's worth. He just feels a bit too good. This guy's green in his shots and everything. So, might be a, might be a quicker here. Might go to highlights quite quickly. Oh, man. <laughs> okay. Dybala again. No, that's bad. That's bad from me. Nice defending. Oh, what a messy game. This guy's very, very good at the game. It's my second game of champs, by the way. Second game. We're going to highlights early doors here, guys. Nice. Find it, Dybala. Nice, nice, nice. I need some support here from him. Or just my midfield, even. Yeah, and that's why Okafor cannot pass to save his life. Nice. Oh, it's a good chance. Good chance for Paolo. 
How's he still got the ball? Oh dear. Oh, what a finish. I tell you how he scored that, guys. Yeah, I did green time it. But that's because when the ball's in the air and he's got acrobatic, his shots are a lot better and more accurate. He is he is a monster card, man. He actually is a monster card. I think the only thing he's missing is um, a better play style plus other than flair. And um, quick step or rapid. Oh, my God. Oh, my God, guys. Yeah. Get this one done. Get him in your main team. I don't care if you've got 92, 93 or rule breakers. Graham Hansen. This card's better. Play from Dybala there. Or a nice little bit of strength at the very least. Goes again. Oh, he feels so, so, so responsive. Oh, my God, man. This, this card actually feels a bit illegal. It's latched onto that somehow. Might try and find Lotaro here. It's a lovely little ball into Lotaro. Bang. There you go, guys. Assist for him this time. Yeah. This is one of them cards that I think EA have got a little bit wrong pricing-wise. He plays so much better than, what, like 200k's worth of fodder. Oh, my God. Here we go. Tell me this card isn't insane. Okay, guys. Review is in on player of the month 90 rated Paolo Dybala. Um, the bottom line is you need to complete this card. He is so, so, so underpriced for how good he is in game. Now, I didn't really understand why his Travellers were so good. The reason his Travellers are so good is because he's got Traveller and he's got Flare Plus, which does actually affect Travellers if I do remember correctly. But let's talk about this card in a bit more detail. One negative, two negatives really. And they're all on that last attribute detail there with the physical. Stamina, if you play with him a lot and you want to get the ball into him a lot and use him a lot, he will drain quite a lot in game, right? I said a lot, a lot of times there. A lot, a lot of times. Um, physicals aren't very good, not good in the air. Um, poor stamina if you play, play the ball into him a lot. And strength is really, really bad. He feels super, super weak. That's all the negatives out the way. So the rest of the stats are all positives. Feels very, very fast with the Hunter applied. I would certainly recommend that. Shooting is some of the best I've used on the game in terms of the variety of shots you can really perform with this card. It's got good finishing in the box. You know, you can go for the Traveller or you can go for the Finesse shot in the box or just absolutely slam it because he's got such good shot power. His shooting within the box is incredible. His shooting outside of the box, whether it be a pot volley, whether it be a Finesse shot, whether it be a Travella, he is so, so, so good at all of them that you really do have the ability to do whatever you want with this card in a shooting sense. Just crazy, crazy shots. Crazy shots. Some of the best shooting I've used on the game in terms of, you know, the ability to do so many different things. He doesn't have the five-star weak foot, but because he's got Travella, you can kind of shoot from wherever you want and always trust yourself or trust Dybala. Passing... For a forward is incredible and makes you think he'd be a great striker because he's got great passing and then kind of being able to be a bit more central to go for the finesse shot of the Traveller seems to work really, really well for this card. But it's passing, whether it be a through ball over the top, a double X, um, driven X, all absolutely incredible. Some of the best passing on a forward you'll get on FC24 for the next few months, in my opinion. Dribbling, even though he's got no reactions and composure, Cannot fault it at all. Felt like he had technical plus plus. That's how good it was. Um, you know, we've got the Tyro Martinez in this team. He's got technical plus. Dybala doesn't. Dybala's technical was so much better than Lotaro's. It's just incredible, man. Left stick dribbling is on point. Yeah, the reactions are a little bit low. Yeah, the composure is a little bit low. But because the stats outside of that are so good, it really doesn't matter. I'm giving the value for this one a 10 out of 10. I think he's underpriced. 200k... An absolute steal for this card, guys. Quality of the card, I'm going to go for like a 9.7 out of 10. He's one of the best value cards we've had or best value SPCs we've had on FC24 without a shadow of a doubt. Disregard the fact he's got Flare Plus. Ping Pass as well, guys. I wanted to mention this before I sign out here. Ping Pass, if you play him wide, is very good for the cutbacks. So he's got so many opportunities to help you in attack. I think he's one of the most complete players in attack on the game. Yeah, Four-star, four-star. How amazing would it be if he had 5-5? Five, five? But, man, this is a really good card. 
I really do recommend him. Guys, if you haven't enjoyed today's video, leave a like, subscribe to the channel, turn on the bell, subscribe to you. But guys, that's going to be it for me for now, so take care.